1000 and today I have who mom mom and why are we here today mom I don't know well we are here because we have two products that are from Timu that's what we're here for oh we got this one and we have a small one so I'm gonna do these because this one in the box is for my mother so we'll get on to this and we'll be right back uh -huh. Okay, guys, this first one I got as a little one, so we're going to open it up first. Make her wait. This I bought because I put these lights and leaves up around our bar, and the lights aren't working, and I kind of got pissed. <laughs> so instead of fixing them i'm gonna yank them down and i got these instead and these don't have to be plugged in they are battery so we'll see how all these work anyways these were 10.98 and you get two packs for for that well, I have enough light to do the whole night these have leaves on them they're really pretty so you get oh aren't they pretty so they have the leaves in them and then you get these little i guess oh, balls they look like flowers Do to they? me yeah to me they look like flowers so um and then you got your battery thing and you just plug it in i don't know what size this is um let me see these are they're double a's that's what they are so I'll have to get some double A's and I will turn them on so you guys can see what they look like. They also have some that you can put outside around your doorway. Um, I thought they would be pretty too around the doorway. I don't know if I'll get them this year. Maybe next year I'll do that. But these are cute. Yeah, they are cute. Mm -hmm. They'll blend in with the mm -hmm. other leaves up there. Well... I'm going to have to take that whole thing down yeah. because the lights are only half working. Oh. And before we clicked on it, we got them all working. And then one day I was bragging to your sister about how great they were working, how pretty they look. And the half went as I was talking. <laughs> so I jinxed myself. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll try to put this up later on. And when I, when I get them up, I'll show you guys. So we'll do that. Okay, so I'm going to have to back you guys out a little bit for this one. Okay, the next thing that I got, this is really for my mother. It's for her so she will work out and exercise and keep herself strong. This is called a mini bike. That's what it's called. It's really small. <coughs> it's a stationary <laughs> mini bike. It doesn't ride up and down the road. <laughs> I paid for this was $28.36. So, um, yeah. <coughs> so we're going to open this up and see how it works. Hopefully I don't have to put too much together. Um, I don't know. So we'll see here. Let me see. Open this up. So, all right, I'm gonna put this on the floor because it's got all kinds of doodads in here. Oh my goodness, there's a wrench in here. That's called Shea Bear's work. <laughs> yep, I see a Shea Bear coming out. Poor, poor Shea Bear. I know, poor Shea Bear. Then you have. Whatever that is. I don't know. That could be the handles to it. This, I would think, are might be the handles to it. <clears throat> okay. No, they have handles, too. You can do both ways. You can do pedal your feet, and, or you can pedal your arms. I don't know if you can do both at the same time, but I know you can do both. So, let's get this out, if I can. 
it's not working. And I don't really want to break the box. Jeez. Trying to get my arm in here and it's just not wanting to come. Alright, I'll be right back. So we pulled and we got it out. It wasn't easy. I would say this is the bottom part where it sits on the floor. It does have some rubby parts here. There's some rubber down there, so it keeps it from sliding, hopefully. We'll see how well it does on this tile, too, because um, it could make it slide. You might have to put something underneath it to not, not make it slide. There's um, another one here. And one, I believe this one's for the front part, and this is for your back part here. And then you have the whole base here. So it's like this. You also have, I'll show you this. This is it. It's just a it's just a regular one. It's it's nothing fancy. I didn't want to get anything too fancy because if I do and I spend a lot of money on it and she doesn't use it, I'm gonna hurt her. So, um, yeah, so we wanted to make sure that if she doesn't use this, um, I didn't, me. I didn't spend a lot of money on it, you know, or she did. So, yeah, see, I see you move it. Yeah. And you can do your arms here like that. And then it shows up here on the clock. So what wow. you've done. Okay. Yeah. So, and you can reset it. Yeah, you can scan time, discount, and calories. So it will also time you and tell you your discount, um, how, how much your calories, discount. your discount that you're going to get, how much calories that you burned off. I, I just burned off 2.4. Yay. Let's do this some more. Okay. So it also gives you your, um, it gives you a manual. Also, the manual is on my phone, too. So, I don't know if this is a quick manual here, like some of them do. This is English. This is how to put it together. This is English. It's a little bit there. I don't know if I can do this on my own. I'm going to try, and if I have to, I'll yell for a shaver. But I will try. It doesn't look too complicated, I don't think. It shouldn't be too hard to put yeah, together. Right. No, there's not that many pieces here to, to be complicated. So, um, yeah. So, let me check this out and see what I can do. Okay, guys. So, what you do is this is the bigger one. So, you put it in the slide in the front one. And then this little one goes in the back. And they just slide on. And then you got four bolts. And with nuts or whatever they call those things <laughs> <laughs> and you got get an allen wrench right that's what they call these right yeah. and then you just put it in there and screw it in that's all you got to do so you get four of them so the two in this hole and two in the top hole here that's it and see you just slide it in so that's all you do so when i get this done i will come back Okay, guys, it took me a few minutes to get these in, um, but I think I got them right. And uh, you just screw and screw and screw until you get it in the hole. And uh, yeah, that's all you have to do. And then this little wrench thing here, you have to tighten it on each side to make sure it's tight. That's it. It's very simple, really. It only takes a few minutes. They did give me another a washer and a screw. In here extra so that's kind of good 
So we got them. So now we are going to put it on the floor. Shea Bear's outside doing a video, so you're going to hear him. And it do this here. Um, let's see what you guys can see. Okay. Bruno's here, so you'll probably see him in the picture. Um, all right. I want to know how to use the digital thing. This just says to install. Okay, it says the trainer must be kept away from children. It is forbidden to use the trainer if damaged or defective. Keep hands, feet, and loose articles away from moving parts. The trainer can't be used by persons with physical or mental disabilities or children or persons with insufficient experience and or in, insufficient knowledge. Now, my mother's used one of these. So, um, she's used it. She uses it with her therapy when they come in the house. The lady brings one, um, and she uses that. So, uh, do not place the bike in a location where it will be in contact with direct sunlight or where it will be exposed to high temperatures or exclusive humidity. Right. Do not place this device in a location where it may cause an obstruction. Make sure that the pedals are on tight. Loose pedals will slowly come undone. Using the trainer with loose pedals can damage the threads on the pedal arms. Do not wear loose or baggy clothes since it may get caught in the machine. Take off all jewelry when exercising. <laughs> they say this, but yeah, that's basically why they do that. But So if you don't do this and you get harm, you can't say anything. It is always important to consult your physician before starting, and they use that one too yeah. because they don't want you to have a stroke and then sue their butts. Do not subject the bike to heavy shock or treat it excessively. More like this is for sitting down, and you can put this on the table to use for your hands. Yeah. But you cannot get up and stand on it no, at all. No. That's what they mean by that. Do not subject the pike to heavy shock or treat it excessively. Do not place the trainer on a slippery flat, which may result in injury. So, my, I don't, th I don't know if it's going to slide with her. Hopefully, it won't. It does have, you know, grips on the bottom of this. If it does, I have a pad that I'm going to put on the ground and put it on top. If this kind of slides yeah, on you. Yeah. I don't know you I don't think you can wear those shoes with this so I'm gonna get your yellow socks and we're gonna put them on and then we're gonna try it out we'll be right back okay guys so I got her on it but it, it's sliding on the tile because we have tile so I do have another rubber thing that I might try later on but this is what I found this is the one I used for the kitty litter <laughs> box and I had it, it's nice and big, but I'm standing on it. But she has problems because she's uncoordinated. That's part of, part of her problem. When you do this, your knees should be almost touching the sofa, sofa there. So you should be like a, an inch more inside. And it, what she does, she pushes against it. So then it moves instead of just riding it like a regular bicycle. That's what she's doing. But um, it might take her some get used to getting used to. It might take her a little time to do that. But see, she pushed it. And every time you do that, you're moving it. And you shouldn't be pushing it. There's no reason to be pushing. You should be pedaling like a bicycle. So, um, yeah. So, that kind of gives you the idea anyways. Okay, I'm going to try it and see how I like it. Okay, I'd say this was three minutes and 52 seconds between the two of us. We're just cheating here. And uh, I don't know. And you can just set it again. It's hard. At, um, the thing on here, it gives you a manual, but it's all in Chinese. None <laughs> of it is English. None of it.
And this is where they tell you about the timer on here. So we're kind of just going to have to maybe see if we can re, um, see if we can use something on uh, online to see if we can um, English. Um, it told you in English here how to put how to put it together on here just fine. But it did not say anything about the timer on here. So, um, yeah. Oh, I guess there's a battery in this, too. Or do you have to put one in? Well, if we had to put one in, the clock wouldn't be working. So they must give you one, but it tells you how to remove it and put a battery in there. So they must give you one because this is on. So that's kind of nice. Probably. But... So, yeah. So I don't know um, how to use a clock. I have no idea. So that that is, you know, a thing because it shows it kind of right here, everything, but it's all Chinese. <laughs> yeah, see, Chinese. So you just take a course. So if you're Chinese and you know how to do the clock thing, let me know, please, down below because, yeah, I mean, it runs. You can see it and you can turn it on and then you, you must hold it for so many seconds or whatever and it turns itself off and uh yeah i don't know there it goes no, zero here so now it's because it's supposed to burn you tell you how many calories you're burning yeah, see this is going around so it's how many times i went around in the circle that's what it's telling me so, and then it goes to, it's scanning. That might be whatever 13 is. I don't know. 142 calories? You think I burned that already? Okay, we're good. <laughs> I don't think so. So, that's my thing is the clock. I will have to see. Maybe I can see if they have a video on the website um, and see if I can see it. So probably in Chinese <laughs> it's probably in Chinese too so I don't I don't know um but anyways we'll be right back because we're going to go to the table I'm going to put her in the chair on the table and she's going to use it for her arms we'll be right back okay guys so she's trying to do it but I think the tablecloth is interfering a little bit is that too hard and lighten it up this is your tensioner here, so you can make it lighter or harder here. So let me move the tablecloth real quick, okay? So we'll just push it back because it might be interfering. And we'll just push it back. Okay. Make it a little bit easier here for hers. Okay, now put your hands in there. No, put your hands, no. You put your hands in just like your feet. Put your hands in just like your feet. Now, bike. Turn it. Is that too easy? Right now, that's fine. Is that pretty good? Yeah. Yeah? How's that work? Good because it's not hurting this arm. Yeah, she broke her, uh, what, that right arm? Yeah. Yeah, she broke her right arm. Um, so. And it hurts when I do this. Yeah. So, so, but it's good for her because if she doesn't keep it going, she's going to have a frozen arm. So, uh, that's why I wanted to keep things going here all the time. So, yeah. I think my mic's not always on. I don't know what's going on. Oh, there it goes. I'm sorry. So, anyways, um, yeah. So, there you go. It is. Watch it because it is coming off the table here. She likes to push these things. I don't know why. You're not supposed to push. You're supposed to ride it. And she likes to push and push. No, you don't push it. You just ride it. I feel like I'm riding it. So I I, like she I'm does riding. that with her feet too. I think it'll take a little bit of time for her to get used to it. Um, so, yeah. But, um, yeah, this shouldn't slide so much. So, 
you had enough okay guys so that's what it does i want you guys to see especially with somebody that's elderly um because this is really great for them um, they can do this at home they don't have to go anywhere they don't have to go to a rehab place you know they don't have she can do this in between um doing her exercises with home care um you know they only come so long and then they're gone so um yeah and once they're gone then she can do this more so um i'll get her to practice and hopefully this will keep her stronger and will keep her out of the hospital that's my intention of doing is trying to keep her out of the hospital because every week we've been going every week we go to the er they send her home and this time they kept her and i made them take her to a rehab center so she had more time to get stronger and healthier and i think it helped didn't it well they keep you when you go to the hospital they keep you in bed they won't let you walk they won't let you do anything and i know they've asked for physiotherapy in the hospital but she might show up one day and that's it what yeah. good is that and then you go home because what they do is they evaluate you to see if you're good enough to go home that's it that's all they're doing so and then they can send you to a facility where they will work on you like we did with clear sky yeah and she really loves clear sky we're lucky we have it here um because most of the nursing homes so you go into a nursing home you're lucky if you get an hour or two hours twice a week and and that's all you get and the rest of the time you're in a nursing home just for the rehab part is that you're sitting there and watching tv and doing nothing they don't do enough exercises in the nursing homes for these people and i think they should and in clear sky you get like uh three hours on your legs and three hours on your arms that's six hours a day you are working at something every day every day yeah. except for sunday right so that's pretty good anyways guys i'm going to say i'm out um and i hope you liked the video and enjoyed it and maybe this will help somebody who's interested in one of these for an elderly person christmas is coming up it's a great uh, opportunity to buy this it was not expensive at all so um you know they have expensive ones but i didn't want to go there with her because i don't want to invest Shit. money into something that's just going to sit in a closet so hopefully she will use this if she uses it and gets really good at it then we might get a better one you know later on so um you, they got all kinds of them timu so you can go check them out anyways that's it for now monkey says she's out and have a great weekend bye y'all bye she says bye wave <laughs> okay, guys i just was going to show you the on they look really cute I will when I, once I get them up, I will show you guys another one. But it will probably be maybe a short, or it will be in another uh, Timu haul that I show you. Okay. Mm -hmm.